Hey everyone! Welcome to the second part of our exciting video, where we continue to showcase real fights and sparring sessions between judokas and fighters from various martial arts. This time, the matchups are even more intense and the clashes of styles are even more thrilling. In this video, you'll once again see judokas going head-to-head -head with athletes from different disciplines from wrestling and boxing to Muay Thai and other styles. Each fight is a battle for dominance, with fighters testing their skills against the powerful throws and techniques of judo, who will come out on top, which style works best in real-life combat. Just like in the first part, we won't be analyzing the fights, all the conclusions are up to you. Enjoy the action, watch every move closely, and decide for yourself which martial art proves more effective on the tatami. Join us as we continue this incredible journey into the world of intense and spectacular fights.
Thank you. 
Sanchez in the blue corner wearing the black trunks against David Fernandez wearing in his the red. Gi. He's wearing his gi. That, a lot of fighters prefer a gi. A lot of fighters prefer no gi in the MMA ring. I prefer no gi just so I don't have to say gi. <laughs> Sanchez caught Fernandez there coming in. Uh, Fernandez looked like he was willing to pay that price to take the fight to the floor. Referee doing a good job of restarting him in a safer position. Tough to get an angle here in terms of who's actually going for what right here. Inside the guard of, of Sanchez, but not in any position to do any damage, really. Sanchez looks point. like he's, he's working, though. He's trying to get his hips up a little bit higher, maybe uh, secure an arm. Sanchez, the advantage right now, sitting basically in his corner, getting instruction from his, uh, his trainers as well, and what to look for. Nice, he almost, almost got out. A lot of guys are not comfortable on their backs. Nice slam. Fernandez just picking Sanchez up and dropping him to the ground, breaking that uh, the hold he was going for. Again, we touched on before, you, know, you can't really tell in terms of who's got the upper hand. One guy on top doesn't necessarily mean that he's got the advantage. No, you're absolutely right. A lot of uh, fights are ended in mixed martial arts by the guy that's on his back. Um, a lot of submission techniques. But these guys are both working, working pretty well. Both seem kind of comfortable the fight being on the ground. Again, Fernandez is on top, doing a little bit of ground and pound. Not much, though. The referee's going to restart him. Very good. Yeah, good idea. A little bit of an edge to Fernandez from what we've just seen on the ground, but standing up, we'll see. And Sanchez in the black trunks. Jonathan Sanchez in the black trunks with the Panthers kickboxing, and they go back to the ground with David Fernandez on top. Fernandez making his MMA debut here. Fernandez Judy, Judo coming in. He's got the arm secured. That's it. There's no way out, for, unfortunately, at this point. No, I'm totally wrong. Nice work. Wow, nice work by Sanchez. They're getting out of that. Yeah. Oh, he's tapping. He's tapping. Yeah. I was say, you pretty well never get out of that. And uh, Sanchez had a little bit of life there. Well, yeah, exactly. And, uh,